Hey guys, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here. All right, so in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to zoom in and out in Camtasia. All right, so I've got a test clip here. It's basically of a Facebook group that we manage, Creative Business Success. If you guys want to join that for free, feel free to do that down in the description below. So this is the test footage that we will be zooming in and out of. So the first thing is that you want to head over to animations. That's where the zoom and pan button is going to be. And if you haven't used it before, it can be a little tricky. So let's say I want to Let's see, I want to zoom in on the word dream here. You want to choose the point where you want that to happen. So let's say I want it to happen at around the two second mark. You need to make sure you're at that mark where you want to start the zoom in, right? If you're talking about something. And then you want to move these little things here I usually grab it from the corner and then zoom in, but then I'm going to, you can see I passed the dream there. I'm going to just go like this and I'm just going to move it over here and then leave it right there. And that's where the end of the zoom happens, but I want to move this green arrow. This is the zoom animation, this little arrow thing that pops up. And so I'll play it. And then it zooms up there. Now you can extend or shorten this zoom arrow however you'd like. When you shorten it, you're going to make the zoom effect happen faster. And then when you stretch it out, you're going to make the zoom effect longer you're stretching it out so you can do a slow zoom in a fast zoom in whatever you'd like now the question I get is okay I've zoomed in how do I get it back to normal like how do I get it back to its original state so you need to place your cursor wherever you want it to go back to normal so let's say you've talked about that thing and you now want it to go back to normal you place it where it is, where it needs to be. And then here, this, you need to stretch it back out. Now I'm going to move that to the side and then stretch it back out to its original state. And its original state for me was, because I chopped a little bit of the actual screen, so I have it just like something like this. That's how I had it. And if you go over here, it's relatively the same. So now you're going to see the zoom in and then here, this is actually going to be the zoom out. Now you can move this if you wanted it to happen later. And again, you can shorten or extend the arrow based on how fast you want the zoom to be. So I will just play this here, play it, and then it's going to zoom out. Now you can, like I said, you can change things. So if you want it to zoom in fast and then zoom out slower, you can. You can stretch this thing all the way if you wanted to and do like a really slow zoom out or a zoom in. I'm sure you've seen it on other videos before. And let's say you don't like this anymore. You don't want it. You just highlight it. Make sure it's yellow because if it's green, you're not going to delete it. Just click on it. Make sure it's yellow and then click backspace or delete and then you've deleted it. And then you can do that for this one as well. So let's say you want to zoom in but then move to another section while still zoomed in. So still going to be relatively the same. Find the place where you want the zoom. And then let's say we want to zoom in on the top corner where it says creative business success. 
right there. Okay, that's where we want the zoom. And then we want to go and pan across down. So I'm going to move it over. I want it to happen over here. You take this and you just move it along, let's say over here. And so it's going to move from over there, up in the corner, left corner, and it's going to go down to the right. So I'll play it here now, zooming in and then there. So it happens pretty fast. You can do it slowly if you want, stretch this out and then zoom in and then a slower slide over here. And then, so you've done that and then now you want to get back to normal again. You want to get back to your original state. So let's say it's over here. You just move this back to its original setting. Put it right there. Zoom out. And then, yeah, that looks about right. So let's just play the whole thing again. So we're zooming in, top left corner, then we're doing a slow drag down, and then we'll zoom out as a whole. So there you go. That is how you play around with the zoom and pan button in Camtasia. All right, guys, if you like these kinds of videos, I have a nine plus hour Camtasia course that you guys can get two months free access to. I have tons of tutorials just like this. If you really want to speed up your learning in Camtasia, I highly recommend checking it out. That will be in the description down below. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Back, back, back from the dead.